How's it going, everyone? My name is Reverse Penguin, and today we are playing Lily. Oh, Lily's Well. Uh, scam I found on Steam for free. Uh, it says it's horror. <laughs> and the music is obnoxiously loud. Let's see if I'm even going through. Hold on. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. <clears throat> Let's start. It's a cold, rainy day in the, oh my god, Hibachi household? You are... <clears throat> Sorry, that's how I greet my cat, Lilith. Lilith is a young, innocent girl, nine years of age. I live in the modest home with Papa. It's a cold and rainy day. You are knitting on the couch while Papa packs his things. I need to go work in order to teach a night class. As Lily is a good child, Papa trusts you to stay safe while he's not. Before he leaves, Papa makes hot dogs and box mac and cheese. Pog. He also helps you pour the cheese sauce on your hot dog in order to make it taste better. Interesting. <clears throat> you enjoy your meal together, ignorant of future events. Papa puts you to bed with the sound of the rain lulling you to sleep. I also use the sound of rain to go to sleep. It's. Yup. You wake to the sound of a voice. Lily. The voice seems to have come from outside. You look beside out beside your window, and nobody there's nobody among the rain and darkness. Was it just a dream? You open your window to crack a crack to listen a little closer. Please, it hurts. Hell. <clears throat> the well, someone is in the well. The rope normally hanging from it has vanished. Some stupid ass fell down the well. You were a good girl, so you get out of bed and go to help. Read instructions? I probably should. Controls? I don't want to read anymore. Okay. Wait, can I use WASD? Oh god, it's the fucking... Ooh, this is weird. What this? Knitting basket gives you comfort despite the storm of weather. I'll take the big yarn balls probably could be unraveled into a large rope. Yes. Teddy. This is Sniffle Bear or Sniffles for short. We're taking Sniffles with us. Fine, we're not taking Sniffles with us. Alright, we're in the shitter. Anything in the bathroom? It's empty. How about in the toilet? Behold! The toilet! And after a time you made potions in it, causing laundry soap bubbles to completely fill the bathroom. Never clogged even when you put at the end of the ball down and watched the entire ball disappear in the water. Truly the most sacred appliance to be created. Look, the bath has many water safe. This it's like a vault. <clears throat> Seems to have a space for six numbers. No, I don't fucking know, bro. Look. Music in this game is extremely loud. I just realized the entire room is like moving. It's kind of tripping me out here. All right, we're in the living room now. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Uh, let's take the whole goddamn fridge. I hear a cat fucking around in the background. There's a key right there. 
There's a key on the board it's where Papa hangs the keys. Wait. Too short for it to reach. Oh, hold on here. Yeah. Wait, what is this? Is this something on the ground? No. this? Oh, it's just my hand, apparently. Key to the shed. Take it? Yes. Alright, we got shed key. Uh, what's this room? Or is this the exit? It is the exit. Alright. We're outside now. There's the well. What the fuck is this? Pretty big rock on the ground. Let's take it. It's probably gonna be heavy. No, I guess not. Oh, you little baby. Is this a shed? What is? Someone in a language you don't understand. Alright, so it's a bag of mulch. No, I don't need that. There's a spare extension for... Take it. Maybe stick a new looking. Yes. A pair of bolt cutters are hanging on the wall. Let's take it. You'll be fine, you old bitch. Old broken weed whacker is left. Uh, this broke a while ago after Papa dropped this in the river. How, how do you fuck up that bat and drop it in the river? What this? Large pair of garden chairs are buried in the ground. Take them, okay? Yes. Taking the shears too. What is this? Can't tell. <clears throat> Alright, the well. We hear now as echoes of raindrops. If you wish to save the person trapped in the well, you will need to construct a rope. Uh, inventory? Ah, oh, shit, hold on. Hold on, boys. Oh, here we go. Okay. I'm gonna go back now. Escape? Yes. Uh, hold on. I need to read the instructions. This ain't working, homie. I should go back. Fake. No, that's stupid. Controls. Using items. Certain objects and structures require the usage of. Yeah, yeah. Use an item. Not the main menu screen. Escape. Interesting. So are we just saying fuck it for this first run? Um... <laughs> I guess we're saying fuck it for this first run. Uh-oh. Your rope is... creaking. Something is very... <laughs> dead. GG, boys. We did it. Let's go. Is that the end? What am I waiting for here?
Oh, Jesus Christ. Was that how long it took me to hit the bottom? Tell you were lucky to land head first, killing you instantly. Your body lays in a unnatural state of the wage for the maggots to settle in. Bruh. Okay, so we've we've established. We've established. Your mom is a bad craftsman, okay? We've established that um they're small okay, we're not gonna stop. Focus and show. Okay. Skip intro. Yeah, we can skip the intro. Alright. Ah oh, fuck. Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. I'm trying to take that shit. So basically what I'm getting out of that is it's a long fucking way down. The main goal of this is to apparently get the fucking stool. Okay, so we got the shed key. I'm no longer using my mouse, by the way. Bethany's mirror can be some of the most dangerous and most and the most useful to forgers. I'm looking for forged materials, the most dangerous vine. Stay away from is the overcast vamp vine. This vine can be identified by its bright purple suction cup like leaves that only open in the rain, rainy and overcast nights. Touching these leaves will cause the vine to grab its prey. Attach it to many suction cups as possible to the victim skin. It will use these suction cups to rip the skin. <laughs> Jesus. Fucking Christ, homie. Uh, keep reading, yes. Another vine that can be dangerous is the Womb Ripper. Jesus, that is a killer from a game. Despite its name, it doesn't actually rip out wounds, but it's still dangerous and it can't be understand. underestimated. The Womb Ripper is dangerous for those who eat bright red berries off the vines, touching or squishy berries will appear to be harmless after being consumed. The berries will latch onto the inner this. Like a tame worm, the seeds inside the berries will steal nutrients from the host before eventually sprouting. Sensing the sun outside of the body of the new plants will violently burst out of the host's organs, like leaving the host to bleed out the new vines to grow on the nearest tree or the largest. The body will be used as the wound ripper as the extra food throughout its life. Luckily, the wound ripper. Hey, stop messing with. Who's that? Bean, stop messing with stuff. Uh, this makes it easy to incinerate. Keep reading this section. He has one vine that is both dangerous and useful. Forgers is known as the O for these punishment. Often found in the shady areas along the tall trees, Ordelli's punishment can be easily identified by blue thorns growing along it. Take extra care not to be pricked by these thorns as they will be inject an intense hallucination that will last around 12 hours on average. They will additionally cause an intense itchy sensation on the victim's inner, inner organs. Jesus. By removing these thorns, though, this vine can be used um, very happily building materials. It's capable of pulling an average of 460 pounds of weight even after being dried out. Jesus. Keep reading. For those suffering from joint pains, you may want to look for the flowers of Icarus. These yellow flower vines grow swiftly in the rain and thrives in the deep wooded areas. By licking the pollen off the flowers once a day, humanoid joints will begin to repair themselves. It is, however, important to not take the vine itself or pick the flowers. After being removed from where it's originally planted, the roots will quickly start growing micro fractures, causing it to be easily destroyed after a little amounts of pressure. Woo! It's operating. Fun times! Wait, anyone? Anyway, I want to go. Yes. Nine, one, one. It's a big no-no number. But someone's fucking dying, homie. One, one, one. Wait. Two, two, two. Three, 
three, three, three. Start to call, but hang up before it can be picked up. Opposite, you should never call numbers you don't know. Call your mom. Oh, okay. Uh, I think I can go grab the bolt cutters actually. Don't worry, person that's probably not a person is probably going to murder me anyways when I get down there. I will eventually get down there to help you. Okay, so we're gonna grab these. Uh, one of the cats decided to take a do, so now it smells in this house. Cool, cool. Don't care if they're heavy. Take this. Are you really using a bag? Bro. Dude, I'm gonna fight these cats. Wait, can I get anything up here? I don't think I can. <clears throat> so this game is a lot more interesting than I thought it was gonna be, to be honest. I thought this was gonna be some really short game. Well, hold on here. What is this now? There's a pretty big rock on the ground. Now we'll go back. So we're gonna come back in here now, and we're gonna use the bolt cutters on... Um, how do I do this again? Yeah, I don't give a shit. Oh, What's this? A large sealed bag of beef jerky. Dude, we taking the beef jerky. Array of canned foods are stacked on the pantry shelf. Chicken noodle soup, chicken soup with rice, tomato soup. Favorite soup is in here. So what was the point of this? Fuck your padlock, Papa. today. I'm sorry, what? What the fuck was that? At that point, bitch, we going back inside and going to bed. Uh... Okay, I'm gonna drop this rock down here. Alright, this game has chosen death, I, I see. Oh, I can run. Hmm. 
I'm not sure where I leave this rock. Maybe in this shrine? Oh, really? It wants me to bring it all the way fucking back? Yes. Whatever. I don't like the idea of going back here, but whatevs. Honestly, though, I'm like a little lost. Might be used the plants or whatever. Cave entrance down the stream. The rain is causing the stream to move too fast, making it dangerous. Oh, hold up, big dog. This was a great idea. That's right. What were... Hold on, I'm gonna have to go back and look at those statuses real quick. Fucking world is this, only?
Okay, so fuck. Stay away from uh, the purple ones. Don't eat the red berries. I'm trying to just remember these fucking... Nope. Sniff here? No, really? Your mom's really nothing more than dead late. Ooh. Smelly? Are you serious, bitch? I'm a little lost at the moment. Not gonna lie. Oh, hold on. There's someone else over here. Ooh, hold on here. Yes, 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 yes. Here are the fucking blue vines. Uh, I'm assuming we can use, like, the shears? I don't know if Okay, so we got that now. Uh, this is the heel, I'm pretty sure. As long as we don't eat it, it's fine. Right? Correct? Hold on. Now I gotta read this. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're fine. Okay, so let's try and make the rope. Really? 460 pounds though? Bitch? Bye bye. <laughs> this bitch dead. 460 pounds. Are you 460 pounds? 
Should I just do... Okay, I'm going to try it one more time before I call it for this game for now. Yep, ow, head first. Okay, I'm going to just try with the blue, the blue vine or whatever. Yeah, dead end, dead end these nuts. Okay, I'm going to just quickly try one more time. I'm running out of time to record. Ooh, interesting. Yeah, okay. So... Oh yeah, I gotta get the shit key. Wait, do I? No. I don't even have to get the shit key. All I need is... No, I need are these. Be a letter in here now? No, man, I'll fuck you then. Anything down here? Huh? Yes, yes, scary, spooky. Alright, uh, let's try this. Because this apparently can hold 480 pounds. Let's go, bitch. Ooh, we're making it further. Ah, shit. Oh! <clears throat> yeah, Lily did. <laughs> I'm looking at my imaginary watch. Oh, Jesus. Rough. Dead. Don't look up. All right. Well, we are not doing very well. What's that? The average water temperature of the Lake Champ uh, Champlain in the spring is 39 degrees. Oh shit, I meant to do that. Anyways. Hot dogs and wieners, boys. My type of fucking dinner, boys. Um. Nope, loading errors. What the? What? What is happening? I'm sorry, what the f- <laughs> Wait, hold on. What is this? Why- why do I have like a blimp? Hold on, this game is suddenly getting weird, homie. Okay, I'm a little confused now. Let's see what's on. Take it. I don't really want to be around yeah, for some reason. My game keeps glitching now? Is this part of the gaming experience? Or am I just actually just bugging? I couldn't tell you actually. It's a little annoying, not gonna lie. But now I'm mildly interested. Bruh! Fucking what? What is happening right now?
Bruh. I'm sorry, but what the fuck is actually happening right now? I can't tell if this whole error on the screen is in the game won't cause progress that affects multiple playthroughs to be erased. Ugh, it's still fucking doing it. I wonder if that's just... Bruh. She actually just goes and gets hit by a goddamn car. No mail today. Okay, this game's a little weird now. <laughs> it's a little weird. I'm a little weirded out. Not gonna lie. Wait. Isn't this supposed to be locked? Fuck off! Uh, stop. Stop. I think that's just the game breaking. Start the game real quick. I want to see if it keeps acting. Yeah, it keeps acting up. Give me a second. I'm going to restart the game and see if it continues doing it. If it does, that's a little unfortunate. Oh my god, there's 15 achievements. Shit, that's way too big. Give me a second, I'll fix it, I'll fix it. It's apparently just a save. Well, I don't see, um... It's not doing... This is weird, like honestly. Wait, what is this? There's something watching you from the darkness, bro. Um. It's time to go back to bed. Like, actually. I'm trying to figure out, like, what to do here. Chain serves as a handrail. Ooh, I can take it? Well, hold on, big dog. Your mom's a heavy tool. Okay, um... Wool cutters? Let's try this. These are tough pieces. Da, 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 da. Oh. Ah, shit. 
Don't look up. Don't look up, please. Oh, and she just fucking fell this time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh my god, how far down is this book? Brutal. I am not good at this game, guys. Butterfingers? Really? Oh, hold on here. Um, We're getting numbers, by the way. I think we've... Uh... I'm gonna have to write this number down. What is it? What was it? Eight two. Hold on. Eight two, I believe, are the only numbers that we've gotten so far. An auto save is created whenever the map changes if bad decisions is made. It can be erased by exiting the game before going to another map. Uh, last time we didn't skip the intro, it like, it fucked up the entire game, so I'm a little interested to see what happens. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Is there just like, yeah, the, the ending of going to bed? Let's just go back to bed. Ooh, okay. All right. Um. Wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. shower curtain. Okay, and we got, hold on here, we, I'm a little, like, confused, just be here, is that thing getting darker? I don't know. Alright, we're fuck. Okay, so now uh, we also want to get the uh, bolt cutters here. I'm playing this game longer than I thought I was going to. I may have to split this up. Uh, so. Stuff. Bolt cutters, use. Wait, hold up, big dog. Um, can I use the rope? Can I just fucking use the rope? Maybe the shears, actually. Okay. And now we want to take... Don't strike me with a car. A letter with a coffee mug stain on it. Read it. Here, residents of Bethany's mirror. There is a recent case of multiple outside vehicles making it to the road. 
completed investigations have shown that they have not, that they were not students of the local college and said ordinary Vermont uh, residents. Majority of them have been directed to the outside world without issue, but some have fallen prey to our local wildlife. If you see unknown vehicle without a mirror uh, charm in their rear view mirror, please redirect them to the main road. Mirror console. Okay. Ooh, I also want to grab... I think the rope is all dependent upon how you grab stuff. Okay. So, now, we have a sh ass load of shit here. Boys. I have six pieces. Let's do this. Well, I was wrong. <laughs> God damn it. All right. I thought it was uh, the order of which at which you were grabbing something. All right, she did. Again. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Your mom. Determining between good and bad rope, it is possible to keep testing a singular part and seeing how the effect of the rock. Okay. Yeah, we'll skip the intro. Wait, um... Let's take these. Um, gotta go grab the shears. I don't know if I'm gonna take the chain this time because it's just slippery. But I will take the rope over here this time. So, stuff, shears, these shears. Uh huh. Let me go check if there's any mail today. Hopefully, I don't get hit by a car. Okay, we've seen this. Um, let's see. All right, let's try this one. I don't think this is going to be long enough, to be honest, but... Here we go! Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Oh my god, we're doing it! And we're down at the bottom. Nearby a lamp turned on by itself. Such a thing could be helpful right now. Reach over and take the light off the hook. What do you mean? <laughs> a terrible decision, really. <laughs> Why? Why, Lily? Rough. Dying light. That's funny. Fuck, I missed it. Three? I think it was three at the end. Hold on. Okay. 
Okay, so we've established that the bed sheets are fine. Just gonna go check real quick if there's a new letter. It's just the same shit. Yeah, same shit. Different day, homie. Rude. Okay, um, I think this time I'm actually gonna take the... Uh... The... What you call it? Huh? The chain. Remember when I said I was gonna stop playing this? I lied. Wait. Ooh. Um. I think we could take this. Actually, no, 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 Almost it convict again. <clears throat> this time we should be able to go even further down. Oh wait, uh, let's grab these as well. Um... Alright, ready to die again? Break on me. God damn it. What, what, uh, what the. Was it the extension cord? It's probably the extension cord. Okay, I'm gonna try next time without the extension cord. I'm bad at this game. I was about to say, any day now. Alrighty. Interesting. All right, grab the sheets. <laughs> Do not need the bowl cutters. Because <clears throat> I'm not... Wait, is there something down here? No, okay. Because I'm not... Uh, I'm gonna cut the chain. And they're just heavy anyway, so. Um. Why don't I always, like, forget? Stuff. Cheers, take it. Um. Cheers, take it, please. Alright, and then. Cheers, take this. Alright, well, we're gonna try this. Oh, wait, really? Okay, 
maybe it's a vine. <sighs> All right, now we're going to try it with the extension cord because I think the vine is what fucked us up this time. Any day now. Just gonna name this episode Zero Deaths. <laughs> There are 15 total rope materials that can be found, but not all of them should be used and co not all of them should be collected and used. Okay. Bed sheets. Take the bed sheets. They work. I didn't grab the extension cord. God damn it. Alrighty. I'm gonna go grab the extension cord and we'll see if that is good enough. Give it a shot. Ooh. Yes. Yes. Yee. Yeah. Shit. Rope has come to an end. The way down seems endless, but there seems to be an entrance to a tunnel that you can reach. Perhaps this is where the voice was coming from. Oh shit. I'm a little scared, I'm not gonna lie. You can see the lake outside. You're suspended high in the air looking down upon it. Weather is causing uh, waves to crash violently against the rocky shores below. Oh! <laughs> Fucking dead. Your body has washed all the drainage pipes into the lake. Before hitting the water, your face makes direct contact. Jesus. Oh, we gotta see this shit too? Holy shit. The game is rough. <laughs> how'd you, how, I'm sorry, how'd you lose your eyes? Not even possible to recognize you now. This game is rough. Dead end. I can drown. I guess you can. Zero. Oh, wait. I might have fucked up on a number. Important information can be found. How's your review time? Stuff in menu. Blah, blah, blah. Suck my dick. Alright. Honestly, this is where I think I'm going to call it, though. So. Uh, I will continue this, obviously, because I would like to get the ending. Apparently, there's, like, a true ending and everything. Um, so, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. I don't know why I'm saying goodbye. I'm probably going to split this up into two videos.